in general, the world, but also for ballet, I think we've needed this reset to kind of step back and reassess how we do things, um, especially for an art form that doesn't really rely on media as much, that doesn't really rely on having to uh, have this um, virtual, you know, we don't really, we're alive in live theater, people come and support us. So it's been a huge adjustment for us to figure out how do we exist in this virtual world. You know, there are more ways than just stepping into a theater that may be a bit scary for people, you know, for some time to come. Um, maybe there are other ways of reaching people um, that don't have the means to be in a theater. So I think this is a step in a new direction that could really benefit the ballet world something that I've been fighting for my entire career um, is to truly show the representation of what the world looks like within the ballet community. Um, the fact that we have companies in every city and country across the world, but yet we don't really see that representation. You know, people think of classical ballet, they think of a ballerina, and they think of a white woman um, that looks one way. And you'll see the diversity within this um, within this film.